Hey, Dijuan, can you tell me what was going through your mind in those last couple clutch minutes? Um, I know it's not a situation you guys have been in a ton this season, but what was the mentality coming down the stretch there? Uh, just play defense and hope it come out, come our way. Hope everything goes our way. What do you guys think you did do best on defense uh, there late? I can't. Can you, say, can you say that again, please? What do you think the team did best on defense getting some of those stops late? Uh, I think we stayed in front of the ball late. I mean, stayed, stayed in front of the ball in the late game. Uh, I got beat, but guys helped me. And we just played good defense at the end to stop the ball. And everybody uh, moved to help. And what, what do you think it says about Selton that as a freshman, especially in a night where he wasn't making a ton of shots, could hit the one there at the end? Uh, hey, a big time play. He's going to have a great career at K State. Only going right. to keep getting better. All right. Thanks, Dishwan. Congrats on the win. Thank you. Other questions for Deshwan, Gordon. Uh, next question of Michael Goins. Yeah, Deshwan, were there some uh, missed defensive assignments, or uh, how do you how do you feel like you guys played on defense tonight? Uh, I, we didn't. We did a lot of uh, a lot of gambling. I did a lot of gambling during the game today. Too much gambling, which caused uh, them to score, which is mostly on my my, my behalf, and the, some of the guys did it too, but. We just did too much gambling and not were rotating. Able, sorry, were you able to identify their shooters and close out on them? Uh, yeah. I mean, not in the beginning. We didn't recognize who was on our behalf, who was uh, shooters. But I think towards the end of the game, we um, got located them and got high hands up while they were shooting to make the miss. And were you guys working on some new sets? It seemed like Bruce was doing a lot of uh, orchestrating and, and uh, directing you guys out there. Uh, yeah, we've the second been, half. Yeah, we've been uh, trying to change up our sets and depending on the team, what will work for them, the way they play defense, depend, depending on the opponent that we play, how, well, how they work and how we how, – um, how they work and, like, what what we can do that to beat them. But – they defensive tendencies. So we've been switching it up and trying new sets and see what works for us and against different teams. And how would you assess your play with six points, 10 rebounds, and quite a few steals and assists? Uh, I think I was too passive in the beginning of the game, too, very, too passive. I should have shot the ball in the second half, too. I should have shot the ball more, trying to create for others and passing up opportunities to shoot the ball. But I think I played all right. Not not good, but okay. I played some defense and got some rebounds and steals, but I played hard, but I didn't do very well today. Uh, next question to Ryan Black. Hey, uh, Dave, Vaughn, just how, how key, uh, I know certainly Selton's getting a lot of the, the credit right now because he did hit the game winning three but just how key was Nigel down the stretch I mean he had a couple of key shots got a steal he just seemed to be really making a lot of plays there in the final few minutes uh he was big time tonight he had a, hit some big shots and he, he he hurt he was hurt but he came in and told the coaches he wanted number 10 and he came in and played great defense on him so he's he's doing great Be, being a great player right now how much respect does that garner from from you and the teammates when when a guy knows he's hurt but still comes in there and says that to the coaches yeah, so we, that let us know that he got our back no matter what. He going to fight with us no matter what he going through. 